When it came to you making a decision about your career after uh, Manchester City, what made you want to come to Bashoksha here and the Super League? I had the opportunity but to play for maybe second part of the table, you know, in England. And when you play 15 years, you know, for teams who play for the title like Arsenal and City, it was kind of difficult to, you know, finish on something like this, you know. And uh, I spoke with a lot of older players who stopped playing now. And they say, and, and they always told me, you know, the thing that you want to avoid when you get to this age and to that point is to kind of kill everything that you've done in the past with those last two, three years in a club where you will not feel great. Uh, you will play for something different than what you've been used to, which is, you know, try to win titles. Uh, and then Bash actually came in, uh, a young club, new club, um, four, year, four years of age. Every year they're progressing, uh, challenging for the title. And, and, and when I came to visit the, the place, it reminded me a little bit of Manchester City, you know, starting something with great facilities and, and of course, uh, a new culture and it's all about life, you know, life is about uh, learning new experience and uh, that's the case for being in Turkey. And the game is a little bit like the Turkey society, you know, they play with their heart and, um, you know, in life they will try to give you everything. But when I say everything, it's pretty much everything. Um, if all goes well, everything is great. If something happens, then they will go crazy because, you know, it's like a crisis when it's not. And on the pitch, it's the same. When you look at all the derby, Fenerbahce, Besiktas, or Galatasaray, Fenerbahce, there's like two red cards minimum, and which tell you they play with, you know, their heart, they play for the fans, and uh, the intensity is there. And although you were quite young, you were part of the Invincible squad, so how did being a part of that squad influence your career? First year, I signed for Arsenal. I win the title. I'm winning the title without losing a game. Of course, I'm, I'm just part of the team because I'm young and I played maybe 15 games. So I'm not the player who made the team win, but I'm part of this. And uh, we are doing the, the walking around the pitch, you know, to thank the fan and we have the trophy, we take pictures. And I'm, I'm feeling really good. And then Cherry Henry came to me and uh, grabbed me by the shoulder and he told me, listen, what you see there, enjoy it. Enjoy the moment so hard because some players in England, amazing players, never won this title. So don't think it's something that comes like that. Enjoy it because it's not every year. And in my head at that time, I'm thinking, yeah, right. My life is going to be so good. First year, 10 months, bang, you know. Yeah. Next thing I know, eight years, playing hard, working hard in training, in the gym, cold weather, good weather, trying to make everybody happy. No trophies. Football is about timing. Life is about timing and luck. And uh, I came at that moment, I could have signed the next year. And then for seven years, nothing. You've won uh, three Premier League titles and you've also played under some of the greatest managers domestically and internationally. Which managers would you say have made an influence, a huge impact on your career? Someone like Arsene Wenger uh, made me a man, made me the player I am today. He's all about positivity, you know. He's like, he's like to be positive. I remember one game and I didn't like my performance. I wasn't that great. So um, I came to him and saying, oh, you know, uh, I would like to have feedback about what you feel. And he told me, listen, Gail, you know, you're only 17, 18. When I play a player like this at this age, I don't expect him to make something amazing into the game. I just want him to be there and to live the moment. And I want to know and I want to feel that I can count on this player. And you gave me that. So don't worry about your performance. Time will come where you will play great. You will play in your position and everyone will be happy. So just enjoy. And then you have someone like Guardiola. If we are talking about someone close of being a genius in football, he's, he's surely the guy. Um, in one year, a few months, he, he managed to change my philosophy and my view on football. So now when I watch a football game, even if I don't watch much football, I can start to understand you know, how and why he wanted this to be done like that. Everything is about details. So Gail, you could say that you are a bit of a lucky charm because 
When you signed for Arsenal in your first season, you won the Premier League. When you signed for Man City in your first season, you won the Premier League. And now you're in your first season at Bashokshire here. So how's that going to finish? Funny you ask the question because uh, when I remember when I signed my contract, uh, I was having a coffee with the president and I told him, uh, you know something, uh, president, he said, what? I said, you know, we're going to, there's probably like a lot of chance we're going to win the title. And he said, well, I said, because you're my third club and I signed. So first year we should win the title. And, you know, we were just laughing about it. And uh, halfway through the season, we are first. So listen, football is about winning things. It's about winning trophies. And uh, if, if we win it this year, I would have had one regret in my career. Maybe I should have signed a new contract in a different club every year. <laughs> it would have been amazing. But uh, no, yes, it's a small, it's a small thing. But um, I do believe sometimes in life, everybody can bring something to the table. And, uh, and like I've said so many times, I'm not the most talented players, uh, player. There's so, many, there's so much player, much better than me. Uh, but I know one thing is that there's not many players who are as committed as I am. And uh, if this can help the team, uh, in getting that first title for the club, uh, I would have done my job.